Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, agents, and all you other people out there. I am Mountie Carl, and welcome to a Streamlabs OBS demo. This is a brand new program that is in beta, and it just got set out. So I'm going to help you get your stream set up and everything that goes along with that. A lot of you streamers out there who are looking for some uh, overlays or something like that, we're going to check out some of the overlays that are in the library right now. This makes it super easy for you to just set up your stream and go. And as you can see there are a ton of libraries nine pages of them to be exact and I'm gonna go through the setup process with you so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and basically select what game you want because these are set up based on game that you can actually choose one of these like if you're playing PUBG here's a couple PUBG ones right here and it'll actually put all the stuff on the screen while you're doing it so that way you know that all of your your icons and UI elements and stuff like that are there and out of the way so your stream is going to be fine and your viewers are going to be able to set up everything so all you do is just hit that install button and you got your screens here you got your getting ready to start streaming you got your I'll be right back streaming screens and stuff like that it's all set up for you all you got to do is swap over once you install it and you're you're basically set to go so here we go here's my shining face we're all good to go we're all set and as you can see if I wanted to stream right now I could go ahead my face is there on the camera here's where all of my subscribers would be chat box here here's the stream starting soon you can actually put in all of your stuff and I'll actually help you get this set up in just a moment what we're gonna do is once you uh, have all of this stuff ready to go you know be right back hey I'm, I'm out of here F this I'm, I'm going I'm, I'm gone I'm out of here I'm just kidding. So we're going to go ahead and help you set up this stuff and itemize all of this stuff once we do that. So if you want, you know, oh, here's day night mode just in case, you know, as settings, you know, you got all of your basic settings that if you're familiar with OBS, this is where those would be. This is basically just an add on for OBS. So if you really want your stream to look great and you're tired of using, you know, uh, an image or something like that, and you're looking for something a little dynamic, something that you can switch up, you can actually have a different overlay every Every single time you stream so that's basically the way to go about doing this so we're gonna go ahead and show you a couple more features let's go ahead and see what we got here yeah we got that and basically everything that you're gonna need to get your stream up and running so let's go ahead this is where your scene is where you'll be able to change all of the names of everything that's on screen and stuff like that you're gonna want you can actually change your name and put somebody else's name up there it's super easy no more going into Photoshop and selecting this stuff here's the dashboard it shows you when all of your subscribers are and it gives you a breakdown of uh, you know when the subscribers are where to put your stream you can test it all out from the the streaming dashboard and you're pretty much good to go. So for the stream starting soon, we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna show you really quickly how to change the names on this stuff here. So if you go down here into your scene selection, what we're gonna do, you can go up here, right click on the element and select properties. And so you can go ahead and type anything you want into the box and boom, it's just gonna pop up magically. And you can change the color of it, you can change basically anything you want. This makes streaming super easy. They've they basically taken all of the things that were hard about streaming, that you know, getting it set up, getting everything, you know, switching everything. This makes it 100% easier to do. So you can go ahead, you got your icons here. Everything's in the library for you. So, but if you do, if you do not want to use their library images and you wanna use your own, you still have that ability to do so. So you can go ahead and keep everything the same. This is just the easier way. And if you wanna change your stuff, you can go just go back in, say like you're streaming PUBG at one point and now you wanna go ahead and stream you know, the division. You can go ahead and do that from this screen. Just boom, boom, boom and it's done and you go in <clears throat> and you select another one you can even make it look as terrible as you want to with this kind of stream you know based on the game that you're playing so that's pretty much it so and then you got your detailed dashboards it's the same as going to the website and signing up you can use this with twitch youtube mixer caffeine whatever well actually no you can't use it with caffeine sorry that caffeine sucks uh don't use that anyways so anyway so there you go see and it's easy as that when you first start it up getting it all set up is as easy as just going and clicking a button and importing all of your settings from obs over into this 
So there you have it. That is as easy as it gets, the setup. Go ahead and ask me all your questions down below. I'm trying to do these more helpful videos. Here's all the stuff you can actually use it for. I don't know what those bottom two are. Whatever those are, uh, I don't know. But they're adding actual support for Stream Deck and for Elgato Stream Deck and stuff like that. So more features are to come. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Agent out.